I'm telling you, joining Skinny Malone's crew was the best decision we've ever made. Look at this place. I still say Malone's weak. We caught that detective snooping around, and what does he do? Locks him up. Like he ain't got the balls to just kill him. Well, don't let his new girl hear that. She'll start swinging that bat of hers at your face until there ain't no face left. Gotta save up for a new gun. Get a hair trigger. Full wooden stock. Ah, I can see it now. Got it. Lock tight. Shadows now. Get back to work. Thought I 
sob.
box really strong. When they open the door, why is that thing so loud? 
Hello? That you, Skinny? Darla? Who's there? Got some fight left in ya? Can't pick this. Got a nice pair of cement shoes for ya. <laughs> So I got a question. Why the hell would anyone build a vault out of a subway station? This place is like the opposite of airtight. Because they weren't planning to use it, you moron. We used to pull this kind of gun all the time back before the war. Get a bunch of union boys to work some construction job that would go nowhere. Keep everyone on payroll. Stairs? Who built this damn vault? A fitness instructor? Thank you. 
to do this. <laughs> for us somewhere. The name's, uh, ironic, but don't let that fool you. He's dangerous. Another locked door. Shouldn't be too hard. Okay, I got it. But I hear big fat footsteps on the other side. Once we step through this door, get ready for anything. shoot up my guys you have any idea how much this is gonna set me back I wouldn't be here if it weren't for your two-timing dame skinny you ought to tell her to write home more often oh poor little Valentine ashamed you got beat up by a girl I'll just run back home to daddy shall I should have left it alone Mickey this ain't the old neighborhood in this vault I'm king of the castle you hear me and I ain't letting some private dick shut us down now that I finally got a good thing going. I told you we should have just killed him! But then you had to get all sentimental. All that stupid crap about the old times. Dala, I'm handling this! Skinny Malone's always got things under control. Oh yeah? Then what's this guy doing here, huh? Valentine- Right. Darla, listen to me. You have a home to go back to. You don't want to throw your life away with these thugs. I... I... You're right! What am I doing? Uh -huh. Darla! Where... Where are you going? Home, Skinny. Where I should have been all this time. This is goodbye for us. Oh, come on, Nikki. You cost me my men. Now you and your friend cost me my girl? My friend here just did you a favor, Skinny. You always did have bad taste in women. Now that she's not around to feed that temper of yours, maybe you'll see sense and let us walk. You still owe me for two weeks in the hole. You smug, overconfident ass. Get out of here! All right, you get to the count of ten. I still see your face after that. I'm gunning both of you down. We better get out of here, fast. One. Two. Hey. You three. heard the boss. Get lost! Four. Five. Six. Commonwealth sky. Never thought anything so naturally ominous could end up looking so inviting. Thanks for getting me out. How did you know where to find me, anyway? Not many people knew where I went. Your secretary, Ellie. She sent me. She did? I should give her a raise. Now, you mentioned something about your son, Sean, and how he went missing. I want you to come to my office in Diamond City. Give me all the details. Besides, I think you've earned a chance to sit down and clear your head. I'll meet you there. See you in Diamond City. <laughs> 